I'm not talking, but hello. Hello, game. Gonna show up. There it is. Hello, everyone. Happy Friday night. I don't know what day it is. So after looking up what's next on the NCR quest, I think my game might be fucked up, or I fucked up the NCR route. So we might have to go independent New Vegas, because I've got all the triggers to continue the NCR quest, but I'm not getting it, so I don't know what's wrong. But we'll find out, I guess. Hooray. I also have new channel points now, and I changed some of the uh, amounts for the other ones. Thanks, Queen. That's only the... Oh, game, please stop freezing. He is worth it, but that was just to fill up the slots. Okay, let me try going to... Oh, sorry. It's late here. It's 2.30 a.m., so I'm yawning. Um, the NCR Embassy and see if I can get this quest to trigger. I thought I already did it, but maybe not. I also found another snow globe, but since Jane is dead, I can't give it to her display. Although I could resurrect her and then turn off combat. I'm gonna kill that guy if he doesn't shut up. didn't succeed in saving the monorail. It did in fact blow up. Oops. Well, I didn't know if you killed the guy you couldn't get the bomb off the monorail. Uh-huh. Seems dumb to me. Welcome back. What can I do for you this time? Ma'am? Yes, actions do have consequences. Is house dead? We'll have oh, you're just a random person. It's good to see such an outstanding citizen of the NCR. What can I do for you, my friend? Oh, 
I guess I forgot to talk to this guy. Oh. Early, you mentioned another assignment. So I did. As you may have noticed, our position here in New Vegas is tenuous. We've made great strides. Oh God, I forgot to talk to this guy the whole time. Welcome here. Merely tolerated, and even then, not by everyone. Oops. We've had reports of violence against NCR citizens in a neighborhood just to the northeast called Freeside. Ever been there? <laughs> Maybe. Yes, what of it? Violence is something of a way of life there. I'm sorry, I am a fool. More worrying is the fact that our sources suggest the violence is being perpetrated by the gang that runs the place, the Kings. How's volume, by the way? That won't attract attention. Would you be interested? Sure, I'll look into it. Good. Our men have come up with two different plans for seeing an end to the violence. First, our sources of music sounds kind of loud. To a king named I don't know. The consensus is maybe the song is just loud. Removed. The problem is we can't simply kill him. In the current climate, the NCR would likely be blamed for his death. Oh, okay. There is an alternative option, but my sources feel that getting rid of this pacer fellow is our best shot. If I can't just kill him, what do you want me to do? Make it look like an accident, or pin the deed on someone else. Look into this guy's affairs, and I'm sure you'll find something you can use. I heard there's bad blood between Pacer and the Van Graaff family, who I already murdered. Huh? See? That's exactly the type of information we can use. In fact, that's perfect. Those fancy weapons the Van Graaffs pedal aren't exactly common. It goes without saying that actually getting the Van Graaffs to do the deed would be the ideal solution. However, if Pacer were killed with either a laser or a plasma-based weapon, everyone would automatically assume the Van Graaffs did it. Still, unless you want several dozen hour men at your throat, mm. you'd have to kill him without being seen. Careful, I'll leave the method up to you. However, there is an alternative if you'd rather try to handle things without bloodshed. In that case, we could take a different tact. The one that at least- Yeah, why don't I kill Pacer? <laughs> if we can't go after the man responsible, we'll simply appeal to the man above him. The Kings, including our friend Pacer, report to- And then you turned it off? The man who calls himself the King. I already know all this. <laughs> He's Caucasian, in his mid-30s, and extremely charismatic. It's that last part we're counting on. The Kings are a bunch of young hoodlums who aren't inclined to listen to anyone except him. Get him on your side, and the rest will fall in line. Go and talk to the King. Try to convince him to put an end to this violence. Pacer's a punk, but he won't likely disobey a direct order. The King might not be open to the idea at first, so you may have to integrate yourself with him. Do whatever it takes. When it's done, one way or the other, report back here, and we'll take it from there. Guess I'll have a talk with the king then. I wish you luck. If you run into some difficulty and think you'd rather just take the shot with Pacer, that's fine too. I already did this. If I already did this, I mean I've already befriended them. <sighs> Big yawn. Guess I can just fast travel. Uh... <laughs> I muted some of the other ones. I can't stop yawning. Must the door opening be so loud? Uh... Where am I? I fast travel to the wrong side. Mm. A fool. Still hate free side. Can't ever tell where I'm going. Uh, well, there's a stupid Mick and Ralph kid, so. Come to Mick and Ralph for all your it's quiet. 
don't talk to me anymore. Lots of songs going on at the same time. Why, Rexy, you look all better, boy. Good as new. Did my Rexy get a new brain? Sure did. You're a man of your word, no doubt about it. Can't thank you enough. If you want, hold on to Rex for a little while longer. I'm sure he'd enjoy that. Was there anything else you wanted? I need you to stop the violence against the NCR citizens. I'd like to help you out, especially considering all you've done. But that's a pretty big favor you're asking for. And you've already used yours. Was there anything else you wanted? Uh... Alright. I'll see you later. You asshole. <laughs> Yeah, no, that's lazy. I could have just walked there, but uh, I forgot how to get there. <sighs> I wish I had an apple. An apple sounds good right now. I don't know why. Don't cut my yawns. It's rude. We don't have any apples, do we? We should go to the apple orchard before it closes. Hey! <laughs> don't read my mind. Trust you have something to report concerning the freeside situation. Yes, do you have something to report? <laughs> um, the king won't deal with the NCR. That's most unfortunate. In this circumstance, I've been instructed to send you along to Colonel Moore over at Hoover Dam for further orders. The colonel will likely send you back to freeside with a squad of armed men. For all the good that will do. Sounds like you and the colonel don't get along. Oh, I like the colonel just fine. She's a good soldier, one of the best. I just don't think her general approach to things is a good fit. See, the colonel likes to solve things neatly, quickly, and efficiently, through a show of force if possible, and through actual force if necessary. That won't work here. Unless she plans on killing half the population of Freeside, sending soldiers to the area will only make things worse. So what do you suggest? I'd suggest you speak to Colonel Shu over at Camp McCarran. He's much more level-headed about this sort of thing. He's also in a better position to bargain with the people of Freeside, seeing as how he's in charge of water and power distribution in the area. Still, I'm only mentioning it as an option. My official orders are to direct you to Colonel Moore. Godspeed. Godspeed. Let's go to Camp McCarran first and talk to General Shu. Colonel Shu, I don't remember. <sighs> well, then.
I stole a bunch of energy cells from the Brotherhood and then fixed my karma after uh, stealing them. Once again, my crimes are numerous. Because I couldn't find energy, weapon, ammo anywhere. Something I can... Yes? What is it? Ambassador Crocker said to come see you about the situation with the Kings in Freeside. Ah, that. I'm surprised he didn't send you to Colonel Moore. That'd be her jurisdiction. He said those were his official orders, but suggested seeing you anyway. Because he's looking to avoid a bloodbath. I get it. He knows me. All right. Moore's not going to like it, but that's for Crocker to worry about. Go to the leader of the Kings. And tell him that I'll make sure Freeside gets more water, power, and food, as long as the violence there stops. finish that playthrough of New Vegas we were doing together. Can't remember. Ah. You break clicking on accident. I feel like we didn't. I just didn't make the breathing so loud for running. Okay, I need some answers now. These guys just barged in here and said they were under orders to keep me here until you arrived. I'm about five seconds away from telling my men to take them down, so speak fast. I'm instructed to offer you more resources in exchange for your word that the violence stops. That sounds fair. And all I have to do is try to tone down the attacks on the squatters, you say? This is bullshit. Are we even talking about dealing with these guys? Pacey, this isn't quiet. really a good time to have this discussion. Now. Wrong. This is exactly the right time. I'm about to prevent you from making a huge mistake. Pacey, don't do this. I won't stand with you if you do. Then I'll stand on my own, just like I always have. Just like a king should. Watch out! Huh. Well, well, I, I, I can't believe Pace is gone. He was always right here, you know, always cracking me up with some story or another. Anyway, <laughs> I guess he's over it. All right. I'll see you later. Damn. First recons at Camp Forlorn Hope. Now we've got a chance now to hold back it. in our hands. I hope we can defend it this time. Amazing. Nelson's back in our hands. I hope <laughs> we can defend it this time. There's some dead people in the corner, but uh that's fine. I think they I feel like the game audio is turned up. Maybe it's just my speakers. There. What? I have key. I'm gonna try to find Pacer's room. Oh, now they're talking about Caesar being dead. What is that noise? This one's stuck. Wow. Oh. Get out of there. Ugh, he's just stuck in there. <laughs> Is it true? Mr. House Mr. House and Caesar are dead. Do not, I'm not gonna help him. Especially not if he says that. Oh my god, why can't you hear him from the second floor? 
please. Knows me. Is this room not up here? <laughs> Where is his room? He was on the first floor. People say I would have done it myself. No, you wouldn't have. <laughs> Shut up. There's talk of someone going into the left. Of the room. It's not that one either. Hello? It's just the hair guy. Well, I don't know what his key is for then. You can still hear it. I like this music, it's creepy. Love the glitches in New Vegas, very good. Favorite is still the time we found Victor dead on the side of the road for no reason. But then he appeared in Novak like everything was normal. Reverse pickpocket people in this game, like put stuff in their inventories. <laughs> Can I reverse pickpocket that guy and put a dynamite in him? Will he explode? Ah, hello. I trust you have something to report concerning the freeside situation. Kind of like poison people, boo. An update. Yes. How did it go? <laughs> the king accepted. Everyone saw me kill him, literally. The king accepted Colonel Shu's offer of help. Good, good. Shu's a man you can count on to handle a crisis. I'm just glad that things didn't end in violence. Huh? Here, this so, is what we sure. Need the funds initially allocated for this operation. Also, I've been directed to send you on to Colonel Moore at Hoover Dam. She's been following my reports on your exploits with some interest. As I don't have any further assignments for you, I'd recommend going to see her if you need more work.
Buff Vault Boy. This seems like the best one right now. Now I'm strong. My buddies at Camp McCarran are breathing easy now that the Fiend's leader is dead. Caesar's dead. Bet he didn't see this coming when he was having his coffee this morning. Still, it's not going to stop the Legion. I will not take a sip. Down. Still feels pretty good though, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. That was some kind of stunt we pulled. Whatever happens from here on out, we killed that prick in the middle of his fortress. Ought to give the rest of them something to think about. Oh, maybe I can unlock the quest now. Must have been a bitter springs. What happened there? We won. That's it? You won? Tell me about it. Look, we've done some traveling together, but we're not exactly comrades in arms. I'm not ready to swap war stories. Boone. See my share of terrible things. You can talk to me about it. Maybe some other time. I think it's time you told me what happened to your wife. I don't see what this helps. She's dead. The better we understand each other, the more effective we'll be. All right. She... I tracked her down. Southeast, near the river. They were selling her. Saw it through my scope. The whole place swarming with legion, hundreds of them, bidding for things no man has a right to. I just had my rifle with me. Just me against all of them. So I took the shot. Better for her to die than live as a legion slave. Yeah. What they do to women. That's worse than death. There was no choice in what I did. It was more like being forced to watch something you can't stop. All this was only ever gonna play out one way. It still is. I don't have any say. All I can do is wait for it to be done with me. Like, it sounds like your wife's death was inevitable. It was gonna be something. If I'd never met Carla, it would have been something else. Damn, that do be fucked up, though. I should have never gotten close to her. I've got bad depressing. things coming to me. You better keep your distance, too. Why do you think you got bad things coming? Because fair is fair. I don't understand. Better that you don't. Yeah. Wow, Boone's backstory is even worse than I thought. I not mean to keep clicking right click. Our rangers are going to show everyone what happens when we're pissed off. I wonder if each companion maybe has unique dialogue if you go to Caesar's Legion with them and uh or the fort with them and kill Caesar. Or just Boone. Gosh, finger please. They all do. I figured. Interesting. Yeah, Roll doesn't seem to care about what faction you're in. You again. Can you ever do anything with this guy? Hey now, come on. I prefer the term outdoor entertainment bonanza. Besides, have you seen the cap's horse? His teeth look bad. I should be so lucky. You can. Sure, later. Are you gonna say I should kill him? I thought he would go to that comedy club with the ghoul, but I didn't get any prompts for it. Talk to Tommy Turini in the tops. Okay. Tommy Tortellini. 
wait, wrong way. Well, I haven't gotten the top since I killed Benny. I don't even think I ever got a quest called Talent Pool. Is it an unmarked quest or a named quest? Named. Uh, I'm almost positive. Not done a quest by that name. No. Definitely haven't. Hello, baby. Welcome to the tops. What can I do for you? Baby, you stick with me. You won't have to work. You might have a draw at Tommy Terrini up in the Aces. Okay. He's always looking for talent scouts. Don't be a stranger, doll. I'm gonna have to find this guy. Oh, Aces right there. Dig these new rangers all dressed to the nines. A robot killer chic. Hey, hey, there's my gal. The Legion better watch out now. Our rangers are going to turn the tables around. Get your drink. Best booze in Vegas, baby. What'll it be? Uh, Ring a ding, baby. Oh, there Swing he is. <laughs> Hell of a thing, baby. Hell of a thing. Tell me about this theater. Well, it was my idea. Well, me and the rest of the Rad Pack boys. We took it to Benny, and he thought it was a good idea. A few years later, here we are. The best show in New Vegas. What do you do here? Well, apart from serving as a talent manager, show schedule, and all-around man in charge of this yeah, he, theater, he. I happen to be its headline act. Every night from 8 till midnight, come on by to see the Rad Pack Review live, only right here at the Aces Theater. Hey, I know this guy. He's in the DLC. <laughs> really? What kind of entertainment do you have? Well, acts are a bit thin on the ground right now, but every night from 8 to midnight, we got the Rad Pack Review. Songs... Dancing, jokes, we got it all. Maybe I could help find some more acts for your show. Sure, baby, sure. Tommy's always looking for new talent to bring to the Aces. Tell you what, you see any good acts while you're out wandering, give them my card. If they work out, I'll give you a 3% cut of the door. Just swing back by as you recruit folks. I'll get you your bread. Sure, I'll keep an eye out. Ring-a-ding, my card. What other entertainment is there on the strip? Now, why would you want to go breaking Tommy's heart asking a question like that? Here I run the finest entertainment venue in all New Vegas, and you're asking me, what else is there? Nothing close to what we got here at the Tops, that's for sure. It's cool, baby. Tommy's a forgiving fella. Take it easy, baby. Should have bet we'd kill the Fiend's leader. Why do all these people act like they did this stuff and not me, who is standing right in front of them? Oh god, get out of here before the content ID hits me. God, I wish we could listen to that song. Oh, it's still playing. Uh, let's talk to this guy. You again. You should be my bookie. You have something in common. Every time I talk to you, I lose caps. I will kill you. <laughs> Tommy Torini at the tops is hiring entertainers. I could put in a word for you. Yeah? Hey, you're all right. Tell him I'll do it for a hundred a night. No, fifty. No, twenty. Ten. Just don't rob me. I'll do it. Don't sell yourself short. You're worth a lot more than that. Whoa, jeez. What was I thinking? You're right. I'm gonna go in there with a cool head. Tell them how much I'm really worth. I don't know why I was nice to this guy. He annoys me. No I will kill you. <laughs> There's 
not time for a stretch break. So it looks like I have enough life points with Boone to do his quest, but I don't know if I need to go back to Bitter Springs or it will just trigger randomly. do the atomic wrangler and see if that I can send that one guy there now oh, it's playing again I'm being conspired against I've got my eye on you who who are you talking to well if it isn't my number one fan what can I do for you, number one fan? I think you can make good money at the tops. Too bad I got this ironclad contract with the Garretts. They'll never let me out of it. I could talk to the Garretts and try to convince them to let you go. Huh. Good luck. Garrett's a tough, mean son of a bitch. He's not likely to give up. Let me know if you make any headway. Yeah, go on. Scram. It looks like the Legion and MCR are getting ready for a fight. I hope that doesn't end badly for us. Doesn't look good. This buildup of forces between the NCR and Legion. Not good at all for business in the long run, if the Legion wins. I'd like to get Hadrian out of his contract. Now why would I want to do that? His performances make me quite a lot of money. He's not the right fit for this place. You'll find better performers. I suppose you've got a point. Plenty of Brahmin on the prairie and all that. Fine, I'll cut him loose. He's all yours. Till next time. Any luck with Garrett yet? Garrett's agreed to let you have your contract. You can go work at the tops. Really? You mean I'm finally out of this shithole? That's great. Thank you. Howdy. Howdy. How are you today? Santiago is fabulous. Goodbye. Hmm. Have you noticed the Securitron's acting up? People are saying the house might be dead. The Legion better watch you again. Local vendors are seeing more business with these you know this Oh my gosh. Uh, you talking to anyone the kings for a uh, Tommy Torini maybe? I don't know. Can't think of any other characters off the top of my head. I'm sure there's some somewhere. That guy's still there. Honor to speak with your man. I kinda don't uh I used to guard at the gate, but there's no money in it these days. Just leave the dead bodies around. What can the king do for you? Okay, I guess not. Uh hmm. smart move for the kings to back down. Hey Rex. How you doing, doing boy? Ah. I'm stuck. I'm going to try something the Lucky 38.
of the pretty six still so creepy. Mr. House, when he heard what you did to the Omer, you do. Why, that's just wonderful. <laughs> okay, that works. Nothing is wrong at all. Mr. House absolutely isn't dead. Enjoy your time and things. Yeehaw! I would spawn Victor back too if I knew the code for him, but I don't. Just so we could hear him say howdy partner. Actually, I might be able to find it. Fall out. Let's see if I can find his uh, code. Five seven two five E, she does. Ah. Where to, partner? Yes, he is returned. He's free. No, he's still up there. Where'd he go? Thing. Let me check Boone's quest. <sighs> do, do, do. Okay, I need to go to Bitter Springs. You know, I saw someone horny for Mr. House the other day on Tumblr. He is just a uh, 
emaciated corpse and a robot. <laughs> People will be horny for anything. Like they have a robot fetish, I don't know. Anything else I can do for you? Thanks to your help, I think Bitter Springs has a real shot at surviving. Thank you again. Now we got a chance to hold it. Good. My companions have been lost to the abyss. Is that guy Novak? <laughs> Where'd <do> they go? <laughs> uh... I hear the great cons just packed up and left Red Rock Canyon. Go get them again. Oh, it's you again. What is it? Really? The tops, huh? Well, it's no shark club, but I hear security on the strip is real tight. Even Mr. Bishop wouldn't hit a joint like that. I'll check it out. Thanks. Uh, yeah, yeah. See you later. Okay, let's go uh, get Boone and Rex again, because I don't know where they went. I still have the Lucky 38 for some reason. Got your back. What? What? I never said wait here. Are you coming? Jeez. What is it? If you want. I met Carla while I was at the strip on leave. She said I looked lost. She talked a lot. Suited me fine. I never know what to say. And listening to her, it could make you forget. She stuck out pretty much everywhere we went. Like she was from a different time. A better time. I never met anyone like her. Sure. No. <laughs> All right. He was a... Uh... Name Benny mean anything to you? No, it doesn't. It's already dead.
I'm not really sure where this quest marker is taking me. Oh, it's the cowboy guy. Somehow I never ran into him. Alone, some drifter. We'll bleed the ground red with anyone who opposes our peace efforts. Howdy, little lady. What's your story, stranger? My story's a long one, friend, and I can't say as it's all that interesting. Nevertheless, I'm interested. Well, I was born in a little town out Montana way. Me and Ma didn't have much ever since Papa up and left. Your father abandoned you? That he did. Never did know why. Ma always said he was a real mysterious fella, even when he was with her. Like he was a stranger sometimes. Sounds like you miss him. Is that why you're out here wondering? Maybe. Maybe I just never felt like I belonged back home. Must have been hard growing up without a father. It sure wasn't easy. Ma worked her fingers to the bone to make sure we had enough to survive. And I worked the coal mines from when I was 15. After Ma died, I guess I wanted to find my pa and get some answers from him. Been out here looking ever since, but he ain't an easy man to find. And what will you do when you find him? Can't say as I really know. Maybe I'll just ask him why. Maybe I'll punch him right in the mouth. Hell, the more I talk about it, the more the whole damn thing sounds like a dumb idea. Sounds like you should move on. Settle down, maybe. Maybe I should. Don't suppose you know any place a fellow with a guitar might find a job, huh? Hmm. Maybe it's time to give these tired old bones a rest. All right, show me what you've got. Take his card. Tell him I sent you. Much obliged to you, friend. Wait, I'm not done talking to you. Uh, piss. <laughs> Howdy, oh. young lady. It's mighty fine guitar you got there. Oh, this old thing? Why, thanks, friend. This here guitar is just about the only thing my daddy left me. You been playing long? Just about my whole life. Ever since my daddy left Ma and me and went off to roam the wastes. So long, friend. Let's go back to the tops now and uh, talk to Tommy Tortellini. Still running inside, I saw him. Looks like the troops are back. Good thing, too. This place is dead. Looks like the troops are back. Good thing, too. This place was Deadsville without their caps. Well, if it isn't my number one fan, what can I do for you? Okay, does have anything new to say? Hey, hey, welcome, welcome. Let's talk about the axe I recruited. Cowboy axe? Yeah. He dropped on in here not too long before you. He's got chops, baby, real chops. And I ain't just talking about that mustache. And like we agreed, here's your fee. 3% of the cut comes to 100 caps. Don't spend them all in one place now. Unless it's right here. Let's talk about the axe I recruited. You talking about Mr. Isaac? Damn, baby. When you bring them in, you bring them in. That cat's gonna bring me money like you wouldn't believe. Here's your 3%, baby. You enjoy that. Let's talk about oh, the axe I recruited. <laughs> yeah, he was a hell of a haggler. Cost me a pretty cap. Hope he's worth it. Here's your 3%. 
That ugly mug with the razor tongue? Dig it, baby. He'll be one hell of a novelty act, just like Tommy promised. Here's your three percent. You know it, baby. Take it easy, baby. Can you actually watch the shows? It is eight o'clock. I'll wait for I cannot wait in the air. I'm sitting. Hey. With house out of the way, I hope someone opens the lucky thirty-eight. Between twelve and midnight, you'll have performers, you say. You dig this crazy scene or what? I have to BRB anyway, so we'll sit here and see if anything will show up. You dig this crazy scene or what? Those Securitrons handing out obituaries? Creepy. Ring a ding, baby. That fiend leader shouldn't have messed with our great army. How's it hanging? I hope Swank's smarter than Benny. At least in the old days, we could up and split when things got too heavy. Right now, I How's miss those days. I hope Swank's smarter than Benny. Bitter Springs. A name like that could have only brought bad I hear luck. a troublesome Legion camp got razed to the ground. Our, Our rangers are going to show gone, everyone what happens when we're pissed off. I'll believe that the fiends are gone when they stop their raiding and pillaging. I hope Swank's smarter than Benny. Caesar's fate was sealed from the start. Hello, Rebel Earth Sky. Welcome. I hope Swank's smarter than Benny. Character breathes heavily in the cutscene, loading. Try something. I'm going to go back to Novak. It needs to be daytime. I 
Back out again at Dinky the Dinosaur. Welcome. Come on in. Is the Manny not come up any come up here anymore or what? Back here. <laughs> What's going on, man? Something. Oh. Uh, well, I just felt like it was time, you know. Wanted to have a home. Plus, I was up at Camp Go. But when everybody came back, nobody would tell me. I still don't. I don't blame. Them, but it did take something out of it. Hooter Dam from here. Uh, not too far. We can walk. Just for fun. We can walk somewhere instead of fast traveling as a treat. Do you have anything else to say? What is it? If you want. I'm not sure when I'll start the DLCs. Obviously I'll need to do them before the game ends because uh, once it ends, it ends, but I don't know when I should do them in the game. Oh, well, still. I saw post in game content was one of the things cut due to time restraints. Cute. Get Noin Slayer. Please. Don't know her. We're just walking through the desert. Oh no. It was a mistake to walk through the desert. <laughs> God of fuck. Are there more of them, or are there just two? Anything but Cassadors. What plants can I name from what I see? 
Absolutely none of them. <laughs> I have a bad memory. The one with the uh, the thingies on the top, not this one, but uh, <laughs> the other one. I should remember the name of since you can pick it, but I don't. Yeah, basically. <laughs> Do not put me in charge of survival, we will die. What is this? Is that Boulder City? I guess so. Yes, jalapenos. I know those at least. I should have just gone around. Yes, plus 10 for knowing jalapenos. More of them. White horse nettle. I picked it. We'll make our way to the dam eventually. I think this is the right way. <laughs> oh, there's a sign, so yes, this is the right way. I had to go to the Hoover Dam previously and got lost last stream, but uh, we won't get lost this time, maybe. I would not trust this road. I would not walk on it. Yeah, I'd like to learn the name. Plants are pretty cool. I just, uh... <laughs> to pea brain. You tell me the name of something, then I immediately forget it. Okay, let's find... I know where she is. Just have to remember how to get there. Oh, there she is. Good, you made it. I've been receiving reports about the savior of the NCR for a while now, and wanted to meet you myself. You've proven yourself especially capable, and right now I can use all the capable people I can get. Crocker gets handed the fluff missions that no one else wants to do. When people need something really important done, they come to me. Usually I dispatch one or more rangers to see these things through, but I'm a little short-handed at the moment. Think you're up for a real mission? Ma'am. Since the majority of my men are on assignment dealing with the Legion, I need someone to handle other matters that have arisen. Make no mistake, there's a battle coming, and I intend to make sure there are no loose ends when the time comes. One such loose end is a gang known as the Great Khans. Have you heard of them?
Puns won't be a problem to anyone ever again. Good riddance. We've had reports for years that they're the ones who supply the fiends with chems, but no one's done anything about it. In any event, no one will miss them. And I've got another mission for you. We've had some disturbing reports recently concerning the Omertas, one of the three families that run the Strip. Our intelligence has discovered that high-ranking members of the Omertas have been having clandestine meetings for the past several months. We haven't been able to determine whom they've been meeting with, but if it's Caesar's men, we'll need to act. I need you to uncover what they're up to and stop it if it threatens the NCR. Any questions? Uh, the Omertas were up to something big, but I stopped them. Excellent. You'd think living in the lap of luxury and power would be enough for some people, but no. Now that that's out of the way, let's see. Mr. House was a concern, but someone conveniently dealt with him for us. Oh, that reminds me. You might be happy to know that your efforts haven't gone unnoticed. The Brass have been throwing around the idea of having the President visit the dam for a while now, to rally the troops and boost morale and such. With our recent achievements, they finally feel secure enough to stage the damn thing. But while it's being planned, I have one last mission for you. Several years ago, we managed to wrest the Helios-1 solar power station from the Brotherhood of Steel chapter local to this area. It was a crushing victory, but no one's heard a peep from the Brotherhood since. Most people assume the Brotherhood is scattered and not a threat. Recently, we've had scouts go missing in an area west of Helios, and I'm concerned that the Brotherhood is involved. I want you to find them, and once you do, finish them for good. Any questions? Oops. Uh, yeah, I was googling... Some of the companion quests I think I'll have to... Uh, activate them with console commands. Because I either didn't have the companions with me, or I passed the point where I need to do something specific with them. Because I have enough points, like the trust points with all of them to get the quest, but I'm past the uh, thing. By thing, I mean the point of time. That brother had brawl wiped out at Helios 1. How could they have survived? After the battle, we consolidated our hold on the plant before pursuing our enemies. It was a mistake, to be sure, but there wasn't really any place for them to go. When we finally gave chase, however, they had simply vanished. Some of our people think they had some means of conveyance, like the vertebrates the Enclave used and hightailed it out of here. I think that they found some place to hide close to Helios and never went that far at all. Any other questions? Is there another peaceful way to resolve this? Don't even think about it. Any Brotherhood survivors likely harbor a deep grudge against us. We can't afford to leave such an enemy alive. Any other objections? Maybe you'd like to bring the Brotherhood some flowers. How do you expect me to enjoy an entire brother- destroy an entire Brotherhood chapter? question, and one I've had our strategists think about for some time. Their consensus is that we must focus on the one thing we can count on. With the Brotherhood, that's their obsessive attachment to technology. They'd never go anywhere that didn't have working power. I'm willing to bet that wherever they're hiding, there's a working reactor powering their equipment. That's their vulnerability. 
Detonate that reactor, and we can safely cross the Brotherhood off our list of concerns. Is there anything else? <laughs> Puns have no power after over me, Rebel. My wife Sophie, aka Stada in the chat, tells too many. Uh, where should I start looking for them? As I said, our scouts were some ways west of Helios when they disappeared. Dismissed. Uh... I don't really want to destroy them. Hold on real quick, I'm once again looking something up. Mm -hmm. Who's talking to me? God, so many people talking to us. Oh, okay, let's see here and find out. this line. That's what it told me to type. With a capital O. Very exciting moment with me right now. As I try to figure out what this is. Tragic. that out later. Hello P Nasty, how are you? Hey. Oh, now I have to get back out of here. Horror. Uh, right now I'm doing uh, For the Republic Part 2. I'm okay. Kind of tired, so I'll probably uh, be done streaming soon. So it'll be a little bit of a shorter stream today, but I'm still gonna go for a bit. Oh, thank you for following, Big Gamer Abel. I appreciate it. Uh, just checking out your app, or just checking out this app's your first live stream. Oh, well, welcome. I hope you enjoy it. I use Twitch a lot personally to just find random streamers and relax. 
up. There's some rad scorpions. Where am I? <laughs> Lost. Oh, I totally just went in a circle. Yeah, I like this game a lot. It's uh, my first playthrough, but I've watched my wife play it quite a bit, but most of this is new to me. Um, there should be a button. If you're on mobile, I think the follow button, if you click the stream, there should be some options. And one should say follow, or it's like a little heart, or if you're on desktop, there should be a follow button underneath the stream, I believe. Are you on mobile or desktop? <laughs> that will help my explanation. I can try to explain again. It's been a bit since I looked myself, actually. <laughs> uh, I need to talk to you. Oh, hey there. Something I can help you with? Well, I would rather not destroy the Brotherhood. You're on mobile. Um, let's see. I usually watch Twitch on desktop, so it's been a while since I've uh, looked on mobile. Okay, yeah, uh, underneath the stream on mobile above the chat, there should be a button that says follow with a heart next to it. And you can just click on that. But you have to click on the stream to expand it. Excuse me. At least that's what it's showing for me when I went on a someone's stream. Oh, there you go. Thank you. I appreciate it. Hello, Sara. Or Sauron, I guess. <laughs> okay. Am I not talking to him about it? Hail, brother. May I help you? Didn't see how I was currently looking to destroy you. I suppose it was only a matter of time. I wonder if, given the NCR's current situation, they would consider a truce of sorts. We've given up our claim to Helios, and we don't have any interest in claiming Hoover Dam, so our ambitions are not at cross purposes. Perhaps it's time for a new strategy. Go to the NCR commander and tell her the Brotherhood is willing to put aside our enmity for the time being. Further, tell her that we are willing to send troops to aid in their coming defense of the dam. My guess is they're in no position to refuse. I'm doing okay, Sauron. How are you doing? And, uh, yeah, I'm doing NCR because I've seen... I was between NCR and Independent Vegas with Yes Man, but I've seen the, uh, Independent Vegas ending when my wife played, so I decided to do NCR because I haven't seen that one. But I, uh, from what I've seen, I like the independent Vegas ending best just because I like Yes Man a lot. They're the best character. NCR is kind of uh, weird. I'm fine, or you're fine because you're a robot. 
robot robot supremacy in the stream. We did make a uh, Slim, the sheriff of Pram. I think that's his name. Is it Slim? Whoever the robot is. Okay, we need to. I mean, I could still go independent Vegas, because Yes Man really doesn't give a shit where you are in the story. Uh, Caesar is dead because I killed him. <laughs> and Mr. House is also dead right now, so. But we did revive Jane in um, the Lucky 38, so I could give her. Russian robot privet. Will you take out the boomers? I think I just left them. Or I they're on my side right now. Oh yeah, I was <laughs> uh on the powder ganger's bad side since the beginning. Has the Brotherhood been found? Talk to the Brotherhood, or I talked the Brotherhood into supporting the NCR. And you believed them? Do you have any idea how long we've been fighting those bastards? Ugh, Crocker will have a field day with this. I want to establish diplomatic relations with them for Pete's sake. But we've got more important matters <laughs> to attend to. The president is due to arrive soon, and we're sure the Legion won't waste such an opportunity. I want you to assist the security detail we've prepared for the president. His safety is critical to maintaining the men's fighting spirit. Go up to the visitor center and speak to Ranger Grant. He's in charge of security during the president's visit. Dismissed. Is the president safe? I'm so hoping to ask you some questions. This is no time for questions. <laughs> Get back topside and protect the president. Okay. Whatever you say. Back to work. Oh, they fixed the monorail after I let it get blown up. Might want to save. I have saved. <laughs> uh... Oh, I'm sure I'll fail this the first time. Where is this dude? Oh, you. there you are. Glad you're here to help us out. This is a delicate matter, and we need all the Boone just mean buggy in the background. We got a lot to do to prepare for the president's visit, and not much time. Once we start, we'll be on a strict timetable. Are you ready? Uh, I have some questions. Ask your questions, but keep it short. God, can I use my weapons during the president's visit? We trust you, so you're free to have your weapons. Just don't do anything too crazy. Me shoots the president. What are your security arrangements? Security detail consists of rangers stationed here at the dam. Some will keep an eye on the crown while others will watch the perimeter. Snipers and sharpshooters have been assigned to key locations, and we also have a special canine unit sniffing out members of the crowd. I've also locked down access to critical locations such as the landing platform on the visitor center. I'm gonna need access everywhere. All right, I'll give you full access. <laughs> You have a de detailed schedule for the visit. I have a full itinerary here. Here you go. Uh, do you have any leads on possible security threats? The Legion will definitely try something. We don't have any solid leads yet. I'd almost expect something direct from them. But given the circumstances, there's a possibility of something more subtle, like sabotage. But since we don't have anything solid, we'll just have to keep our eyes out for anything out of the ordinary. What can I do to help? Someone like you. Just glad to have you on board. Do whatever you can. Security sweeps, talk to people, keep an eye out. If there's nothing else, then let's get moving. Make it quick. Let's save an actual save here. Uh in case I want to come back and do something different in another playthrough. Then let's look at this itinerary. Hoover Dam presidential visit schedule. The president will visit the Hoover Dam to give a speech to the troops and award a medal to Private Watson for his bravery and service to the NCR. The president is scheduled to arrive via Vertebird from California. The Vertebird will land on the top of the visitor center where Colonel Moore will meet the president and escort him out to the stage. After a brief introduction by Colonel Moore, the president will give his speech. The speech will take approximately four minutes. During the speech, the president will award a medal to Private Jeremy Watson for his service to the NCR. 
Once the speech is over, the president will be escorted directly back to the visitor center to his vertebrate for immediate departure. In event of an emergency, the speech will be canceled and the president will be rushed to the vertebrate for immediate departure. If there's a problem with the vertebrate, a room on the second level of the visitor center will be used as a safe room to keep the president secure until the threat is over. Access to this room has been restricted and Colonel Morrow has a key in her desk. Okay. We've got a lot to do to prepare for I made my preparations. Let's get started. Good. The president doesn't arrive until tomorrow. Let's get some rest and we'll have a brief talk first thing in the morning. Smart move for the kings to back down. They didn't know who they were. God. Glad you could join us. <laughs> Most of my men are already on duty. And the crowd has already started gathering outside. We've got a busy day ahead of us. This is the plan for today. The plan is to get through today without the shit hitting the fan. So I'll be overseeing the security team personally, keeping in constant contact with people over the radio. It's a good bet that the Legion is going to try something today, so we have to be prepared for anything. We'll do whatever it takes to get the President through this visit in one piece. President Kimball is arriving shortly. If you want to do any last-minute security sweeps or take a look around for anything suspicious, do it now. Once you're ready, meet me outside on the observation deck. Don't take too long. Hmm. Is there a radio for this? No. Uh... Where would anything suspicious be? Anyone being suspicious down here? Good to see a friendly face. Okay. Honored to speak with you, man. Saw people running. Where are they going? I'm meeting it lost. God, it's night time, I can't see. Question, am I lost? Answer, yes. Uh... I don't know what suspicious thing I was supposed to look for. If anything. I'm sure Sophie is watching this with glee as I fail miserably. <laughs> ah, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I can't find my way back to the roof. The president is going to fucking die. God. There's something wrong in the visitor center. Oh. Well, if I can find the visitor center again. Currently, I'm lost. Uh, what's this way? That requires key. <laughs> Not the right way. Multiple things are wrong. Hmm. Um, cool. I just went in a circle. How do I get out of here? <laughs> ah. Never should have gone this way. The local map doesn't help either.
smart move for the kings to back down. No. Where? <laughs> In here? I thought that was just there. <laughs> examine it. You examine the area and notice a, blood wrench, a bloody wrench in a toolbox nearby. Someone was killed here recently, and judging by the scene, it was one of the engineers. You should keep an eye out for any engineer acting strangely. Damn. I definitely did not know that. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I'm a great private eye. We hack the damn computer. This is what I get for playing when I'm tired. <laughs> Unlocking was the password to unlock the computer. Peasants arrival today. Security is running a final sweep of the area, making preparations. Only members of the security team will have weapons at the president's speech. This means that all troopers at the speech must relinquish their weapons beforehand. We will limit people allowed to see the speech through a small number to reduce any potential risk to the president. I've gotten the word that the president is traveling with only two rangers, so a security team will need to be on full alert. I'd still like to log my concerns about not having enough time to prepare for this, but we'll do our job here today. You notice that the duty roster has been accessed by an unknown login ID. It'd be a good idea to keep out keep an eye out for anything out of the ordinary. Basic assignments are this. Rangers will secure the perimeter and keep an eye out for any external threats. Additional rangers will be stationed around the stage and crowd. The primary job is to keep an eye on the crowd to make sure nothing funny happens. I want sharpshooters positioned at the following locations. Visitors in a roof, Western Ridge, Down Tower 1 roof, I want to radio up here to check in. Stay frosty today, nothing bad is going to happen on our watch. We see word that the President's vertebrate is having some issues with the flight control computer. I've had some of the techs here examine the logs that we were sent, and we think we can fix the issue with a small computer update. Ranger Grant has given me permission to have one of the NCR engineers examine the vertebrate when it arrives, as well as having our computer update the vertebrate systems after it arrives. Hmm. Any weirdos in here? I'm honored to work with us. He knows more about the dam than anyone. We won't go quiet. The Legion can count on you. Control in the Mojave. I'm honored to work with us. He knows more about the dam than anyone. I'm honored to work with us. I'll take these out of the trash. Uh. Anything else in here? Or should we just go up? There's one more thing. Mm. Talk to a certain NPC. The NCR is fortunate to have your support. First recons at Camp Forlorn Hope. Now we've got a chance to hold it. I got this assignment. I was hoping to do more damage. I wish I had a first recon guy looking Our guys took the monorail back to work. And just between us, Colonel Moore scares me sometimes. Man, I'm exhausted. Moore's got us running drills nonstop. Those cons got the hit. We've shown everyone that these are our new territories. Sure hope I get to meet President Kimball. Hmm. Wish I could have been there to see the new sky. Uh, are they outside or are they in here? Wanted to speak. Second floor. Oh, I didn't know if I could go up or not.
Hey, you haven't seen my friend around here, have you? His name is Ben, and he's an engineer. We were supposed to meet up so we can watch the president's speech together, but he hasn't shown up yet. I haven't seen him. Okay. Well, I guess I'll just keep waiting. Sorry to bother you. Nelson's back in our hands. Hope we can defend I wish I had a first recon guy looking after me. Still no luck finding my friend. He better show up soon. Uh, make a save, okay. Stare. What, can I not go up here? Boo. Wow, I wish I could see. your security sweep I'm ready will the president be here looks like that's his bird bird coming right now it's showtime let's not mess this up now if you'll excuse me I've got some security procedures to oversee Apparently I shouldn't have shot that NPC. He seems suspicious. Boone, you're gonna fucking die if you don't move. No, Boone, no, watch out! Hey, LOL. Hey, LOL. Please talk to me. Protect the president. Looking at the presidential vertebrate, the assassins could have done something at the vertebrate. Notice a strange item that doesn't belong. On examination, you notice it's a bomb. You skillfully disarm the bomb and remove it from the vertebrate. Anything else? Come back in a minute. I'm busy with security matters. Uh Where are the snipers supposed to be at? I can't see! Why is he here in the middle of the night? Is that how- it, he's here at 2.24 a.m. Is this how it's supposed to normally be? You better get out of here. No. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank, thank you for coming, for coming out, out here today for this very, very special occasion. occasion. It, is it is my, my pleasure, pleasure to introduce to you, to you the president of the new California Republic I don't. What? What? Why am I getting attacked? I was literally just standing there. <laughs> I thought I could be on the stage. Okay. <sighs> Fine. Do this again. Why did he call me a murderer? I didn't do anything. No, he's gonna get landed on again. Boo, no! I guess I'll turn the brightness up, because I uh, can't see anything. Did 
just for now. Yes, exactly. Why are they aiming at me? saying that oh my god okay what a guy <laughs> thanks Boone well if I was the killer I would do this Rex move I'd like to thank, thank you for coming, coming out, out here today for this very special, special occasion. It is my, my pleasure to introduce to you the, the president of the new California Republic, Aaron Kimball. Oh. Thanks, Spoon. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's still alive. <laughs> Boone be like, fuck it. Well, he made it without exploding. Is the president safe? The president has departed safely. Good. His death could have had a major impact on morale. This whole affair was ill-advised from the start, and I, for one, am glad it's over. While you were out, General Oliver arrived and briefed all senior officers regarding a change in our strategy. I'm not at liberty to divulge what was said, but I've been instructed to send you to him immediately. He set up his camp in the office area at the south end of his power plant. Dismiss. I'm not ready yet. <laughs> okay, let's turn the brightness back down. Actually got all three first time. We mean uh Boone killed the sniper immediately. I don't know about the knife guy, and I did disarm the bomb. going to do that yet. So it was a uh, short stream, but I think that's going to be all for tonight because I'm getting sleepy. Uh, I will be streaming tomorrow or later today, I guess. Uh, I'll probably be doing the companion quest by using the console command to unlock them because I uh, passed a certain point for some of them. But thank you for watching, and thank you to P Nasty and Big Gamer Able for following. I appreciate it. Have a nice night, and I'll see some of you tomorrow. Bye.